morning guys, it's Rick here from Oxford Electronics. It's Tuesday, October the 23rd at 9 o'clock a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Uh, today I noticed there is an update for the Movies HD or Cinema HD as you might call it. Uh, we're now moving from version, we were on 1.2.7, we jumped to the ad version 1.2.9 and now there is another release today of the version 1.3.0 which has a small update which is for your Chromecast if you have it. Uh, if you don't have the Chromecast you don't have to do this update you can actually skip over it. Uh, Pre-requirements would be that you have the ad version already installed. There is no ad free version at this point for the 1.2.9 or 1.3.0. Hopefully that will be released later today or maybe even tomorrow uh, as long as they stop doing these little patch updates. So let's walk through today on how to set up the 1.3.0 ad version. So we're going to remove our existing Cinema HD that we have here. Uh, if you go into it right now, it's going to come up with a message. It's going to say, here is our newest version. Please go here and to install it. Now, there's two ways that you can do this. If you already have the ad version installed, you can click either don't show this again and then cancel out of it or you can click on the install button and do it right through the app itself. I'm going to walk you through two ways to do it. We're going to do it right in the app and then we're also going to remove the app and reinstall it from our file link. So I'll show you both options here. So the first one we can just, if we open the app, you can see if we click the install, it's going to do a little patch and you're going to be able to start using it after we click install. And it's going to ask us if we want to open it. We'll just do that. And that'll give you your change log, which tells you about the Chromecast and then the crash and this other uh, provider they're having an issue with. So we'll just click OK to that. And now it's up to date and everything's here. You now see we're on 1.3.0 with the ads in it. So if we go into a movie or something, you're going to scroll down. And usually we see ads here. Uh, there we go. And there's an ad showing up. All right, we're just going to back out here for now. I'm just going to close out of that, get back to our desktop. Now I'm going to show you the second way we can install this and that's removing Cinema HD. So we're going to go to our three dots. Your layout might be different if you don't have our build. Just get into wherever your applications are or go into your settings and your apps and then you should be able to uh, remove it from there. I'm just going to do a long press on my left mouse button for our to build and then click uninstall and then click OK. And I'm just going to reopen our launcher because ours is on a computer here and we'll get back to our desktop. Now you'll see it's removed and it's gone. It's also not in here. Next thing we're going to do is we're going to go into our file linked, which is where we get our latest updates and notifications if there is an update. And we're going to actually get our code because that is another code for another company. So we'll go here. And then this is our file linked code that was just on the screen. We'll put that in the ad description as well. We'll actually go back so you can see it really quickly here. So this is our file linked code 217. 55221. Once you've entered that, click continue. There's no passcode. And then we have uh, notifications up here. So it says we're working on Cinema HD 1.3.0. Add free update now. We'll post it when available. For now, you can use Showbox or Cinema HD with the ads in it 1.3.0. You'll find that link down here Cinema HD with ads. And you click the download button. And once that's done, just click the play button and then install. And this is just the same as doing it within the app, but if you're experiencing errors or it says it already exists when you go to install it, this is the way you're going to want to continue. Okay, and when we're all done, we're just going to click done for now. And we're going to back out of our update program here. We'll say yes, and then back one more time, and it takes us back to our desktop. Now you notice we don't have the icon here right now, so we're going to add that. We're going to click on our three dots, left click and hold and drag, and move it to our desktop. And now we have 1.3.0 installed and on the desktop. We'll click OK to the change log. And as you can see, the same version right here is installed. And that's pretty much it. Uh, we're hoping that the ad free version will be released very shortly, either today or tomorrow. Uh, just keep an eye on the date uh, that we post at the beginning of the video. That's very important if you're watching this past that date. We probably already have a fix or a new update available as this program seems to be updating once every couple of days or at least once a week right now. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to give us a call or look, put a message at the bottom of the YouTube video. 
Thank you and have a great day.